Did you ever have sex with former Officer Hall? No. Did you ever receive nudes? I received a lot of nudes, a lot of videos. A former police officer who claims he was unfairly fired as part of a department wide sex scandal is speaking publicly for the first time. In addition to sexual harassment claims, former Laverne Sergeant Ty McGowan is accused of putting his hands around a coworker's neck. But that's not all an HR investigation uncovered. Tonight, News 2's My Owen shares more of her exclusive interview as she digs into these allegations. A nightmare. It's been a nightmare. Called me and said, We're going to terminate you. I've never. <laughs> That's not words I hear. It was, it was horrible. I mean, that was horrible. A year since news of a sex scandal inside the Laverne Police Department broke, former Sergeant Henry Ty McGowan is telling his side. Knew everything about everything. I didn't talk about it. A 20 page report from the head HR investigator accused him and four others of having sex with former officer Megan Hall, the only female officer listed in the investigation. According to the report, someone in the HR department reported McGowan writing a statement to the head of HR saying the next thing I knew he, Ty, had come up behind me, placed his hand around my throat and began to squeeze. I froze. I could not say anything. I just sat there. No, <laughs> that was ridiculous. We were joking around and I did not put my hands around her neck. It was more on the shoulders and I was doing myself like this. I was, and she was just kind of going along with it. A witness said in a statement, all of a sudden Ty stands up from the office chair. He was sitting in and grabbed her throat. The witness's statement goes on to say the alleged victim was laughing and cutting up after the initial act. So initially to me, it did not seem alarming. And then you're going to make me look like, like I choked somebody. And even though your witness, your subordinate said they were joking. It would end in the director of HR recommending McGowan's termination, citing workplace violence, conduct unbecoming of an officer, lying during the course of an investigation, and sexual harassment. The head of HR specifically stating McGowan more likely than not had sexual relations with Hall. More likely than not. Would you take that to court? I wouldn't dare. Another part of the investigation. 2007 incident. Yes. That you have brought up. Yes. You admitted to it? Yes. In 2007? Because I did it. Back in 2007, McGowan was demoted after the city said he had sex while on duty. While McGowan admits to it, he maintains he's not guilty in this latest scandal. It's unfair that they released everything. My picture shouldn't have never been up there. McGowan now has filed a lawsuit. That lawsuit is now asking for $1 million in damages. We reached out to the city for comment on it. They tell us they cannot comment on pending litigation. To see the first part of this exclusive interview, you can visit WKRN.com.